Alright everyone, Game for Life here, and welcome back to the channel, welcome back to Fortnite, and tomorrow is going to be the new season. So, before we continue on, I just want to say, make sure you guys subscribe to the post bell and notifications turned on, so you guys never miss a new upload or a new video. So, somebody made a concept art of the mini pass of what it would look like if it actually did get added to Fortnite next season. So, I thought to take a liberty just to show you guys... What it would look like. Not only will be, not only will be, showing the Fantastic Four concept art, but also I just want to say it is a hundred percent confirmed. We are going to be getting Fantastic Four. Now the real question is: Is it going to be the one from the two thousands era Fantastic Four? Or is it going to be the comic version of Fantastic Four? Or is it going to be the classic Fantastic Four? But we shall see. So before I do get to the concept and go over it with you guys, I just want to say that uh, this is right here that I'm pulling up right now. It's the uh, Raft. Doom's... Doom's... Uh, stayed... Stayed... I don't know if I'm saying that right. Doom's stayed... And then we got the Castle Doom. Those are three Marvel locations. I'm pretty sure we'll get more locations on the map regarding the Marvel season. So, that's going to be pretty cool. Hopefully, we get an update with, uh, you know, more Marvel locations that pop up. With new POIs getting added to, like, the collection. Which was related with the Collector um, last Marvel season. Um, that being said, that is the whole entire Fortnite map. What do you guys think about that? I think it looks pretty cool, if you ask me. And we also have... we got like five teasers here. So I'm just going to go over it. I'm going to kind of go out of order. So basically, I just want to point this out because literally, this is confirming that we're getting a Fantastic Four. You guys can see it says Fantastic Four under. So it's probably a Fantastic Four building or, or station there. I wonder if the Baxter building is going to be there. That'll be pretty cool. I think the, ba the Baxter building is where the Fantastic Four headquarters is. Don't quote me if I'm wrong. But anyways, this is another location here. It says right here, uh, Raft Detention Facility. Keep eyes forward and no talking. So I, I believe that is the... Prison cell, I believe. And right here, this looks like the POI for the Doctor Doom's castle there. So if you guys see, there's paintings on the wall there. I believe the one on on the right is his wife there. Now, it looks like there's cat statues there. or Oh, those are dogs. Alright, if you look all the way... I'm going to zoom in on the next slide here for you guys so you can see it. But before I do... I just wanted to say that in the middle there, of that that um, glass window there, in the, in the main middle, you guys can see there's something that looks odd looking and that looks familiar. Now, I'm going to show you right here. So, it's already zoomed in for you guys, thanks to me. And you guys can clearly see that that is no other than the thing. So, this indicates that he destroyed Galactus. He destroyed the, the Fantastic Four. We got the thing shown right there. I'm really curious if, if we'll find the Human Torch and uh, Mr. Fantastic. Like, kind of how they did with the thing there. But he literally demolished them all. So that's really interesting. Also, they will be coming to the item shop or a mini pass. So what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments down below. You guys think we're going to be getting Fantastic Four as a mini pass or a item shop? Most likely a mini pass because it's a perfect mini event. There's four characters there. And they have did that before. They, the only ones I know they did four characters were um, Festival. They had it four Metallica characters. But I don't I don't know. I think I think they, they should add that there too. But, you know, we're just going to have to wait and see. So here is, it looks like an Iron Man. Some kind of Iron Man panel there. I'm not entirely sure what that is. 
Looks like some kind of Iron Man base. And then here's a statue here. Now this looks like we could be a new character getting added to the item shop. Most likely because she's not in the battle pass and stuff like that. So this is Dr. Doom's wife, I believe. And I like how it looks spooky and it's dark there. Alright, I think uh, we're not done yet. I do got to tell you guys about the mini pass at the end. But I also want to tell you guys when the next season drops. Okay, so here we are. So it says right here, you guys notice there's a tab right now. Downtime for Chapter 5, Season 4. Absolute Doom starts at 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Wow! Ain't that early? 11? Oh, wait. No, that's... Hmm. 11 p.m. Wait, is that nighttime? That might be nighttime. Wow. 11 p.m. Yeah, it's really early, I think. Matchmaker will be disabled 30 minutes before downtime. Or maybe that's down. I'm really confused, you guys, but... I'll figure out. I'll probably put all that in the description down below for you guys. So anyways, I think the real reason the downtime is earlier than usual is so we can actually play early. Because I remember in the Greek, mytho the Greek mythology season 2, uh, season 2, seasons ago... We spent nearly a whole day in downtime, you guys. That was insane that we had to go through that. Everyone had to go through it. Everyone was getting mad. And they were like, they're all getting mad at Fortnite and commenting on Twitter. Or you guys could say X, but I say Twitter. I don't think anyone calls it X. I always call it Twitter. So anyways, also my girlfriend calls it Twitter too. But anyways, um, yeah, so the whole day in downtime. So this could be Epic's way to combat this stuff so i think i think it's pretty good we're gonna get this earlier the downtime earlier than it, than usual so again downtime it looks like downtime starts for 11 p.m so i was confused at the start it just says downtime at start there so it starts at 11 p.m eastern standard time so tonight at 11 usually it'll be kind of like two or three or four a downtime will actually start and go in effect but this time it is going to be earlier, so I'm really hoping that when that happens, we can actually get the the update patch earlier. I think that's what they're kind of rooting for. What do you guys think about that? Do you guys think we're gonna we're gonna be able to play earlier than usual? Because usually it's like up by seven or eight o'clock, and uh, in the morning. Alright, so we're going to be talking about the Fantastic Four Mini Pass. Now keep in mind, I'm not saying this is this is like 100% for a Mini Pass, but it's, it's really close. This is a concept only, so meaning that somebody made this and it's not confirmed. But it is confirmed that you guys see right here. This is an image of a teaser that they put inside of Fantastic Four. They wouldn't add that if that wasn't going to happen. So we got the Fantastic Four, uh, it looks like a... Back bling logo, a level up, a staff. It looks like the Human Torch's um, music festival instrument. We got four level ups there. We got the Human Torch. He also got his Lego style. And by getting this, you would actually get the Invisible Woman as a free platinum reward, which is 1,500 V Bucks to get the bottom track. Top is free. So, Visible Woman's free, and then the other three are in the pass here. Comes with the Human Torch uh, thing, the thing, and it comes with Mr. Fantastic. So, going on the bottom here, we got the Fantastic Four spray. that has all four of the members on the spray there. It looks like that's a Modicon for the logo Fantastic Four. It looks like there's an emote right there. I'm not entirely sure what that would be. Looks like people are sending down that emote. And there's a pickaxe there, the thing, and I believe he has a minifigure as well, but it wouldn't be like a big fig, it'd be small fig. Fantastic Four wrap, Fantastic Four spray, Fantastic Four banner, the thing, festival guitar, the the thing, uh, emoticon, which I probably, probably thinking that if, if they get that under all this right, it's probably going to say it's clovering time because that's his catchphrase. 
two level ups and we got the thing's uh, pickaxe which is the hands kind of similar to the Hulkbuster ones or the Iron Man Hulkbuster. Oh yeah I think that's what I meant yep. So the Iron Man Hulkbuster um, pickaxe and then there was also the Hulk hands like the Hulk fist. And then the last but not least Mr. Fantastic that comes with his own Lego style. And then we got Herbie as a back bling. It's a robot. It's the main Fantastic Four uh, super intelligence that they talk to. That they have their headquarter. I don't remember much about him. But, yeah. I'm not sure how that's going to work as a back bling. I think the hands, you hold the hands or, or the feet or something. Something will happen to use it for a glider. But anyways, again, this is a concept. So, take this with a grain of salt. This is not 100% there. But basically, it already is. It's already, it's already confirmed that we're gonna be seeing them at some point in the season. So, this is this is like 99% accurate to what we might actually get. That's why I made a good video for you guys on this, and I never clicked on the channel. So I really hope you guys subscribe because everything I do on here is all straight facts and from reliable sources. So. Yeah, hope, hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. That's pretty much it for this video. Thank you all for watching. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on my next video very soon. Peace, and I hope you guys all have a good one. In tune in my mind, can't seem to break away. Lost in time, thinking about better days.